All right, hello, wine drinking people. Today is Friday, the 11th of October, and that is a lucky number for us because we are taking down a bunch of Cheval Blanc tonight, back to 1949. You would think it's the last month on Earth with all these once in a lifetime tastings going on this month, and you know, we don't know how much time we have. You never know when your last day is. That's why you must drink like it's your last day every night. And uh, we're taking down a bunch of vintage Barolo a week from tonight at Cafe Max. And uh, this should be an annual event. You know, we're going to make an annual event. The first annual vintage Barolo tasting going all the way back to 1958. Are you kidding me? Holy Jesus, it's not even a Barolo. It's a Spana. But let me tell you, the last time we served one of these Spanas from Balana was the wine of the night. And this was at a Gaia tasting. No guy on the table tonight, but we got Red Label Giacosa. We've got Giuseppe Rinaldi. We've got Aldo Conterno. We've got Bruno Giacosa. Red Label's not one, but two. An incredible line of wines from vintages that you just don't see in the marketplace anymore. You know, the difference between Barolo, Barbaresco, and wines like Chateau Lafitte, uh, the great wines of Bordeaux, they make a ton of these wines in Bordeaux. When you look at the total production in Barolo, 12 million bottles. You look at Barbaresco, 4 million bottles. So 12 million bottles of Barolo, that's 1 million cases. There are producers in California that make three times that much just in one wine. Kendall Jackson Vintners Reserve Chardonnay. So this is a very small artisan a craft area when you look at the wine business. And thank God more people haven't caught on to this because, well, you know, like I said, these wines are infinitely expensive. The Giacosa Red Labels are $1,000 a bottle today from vintages like 82, 79, great legendary vintages, 71. And like I said, try to find these wines on the Internet. They're not available. Well, and if they are, they're for incredible prices. These wines are all in pristine condition. Almost every one of them filled up into the neck. This is going to be a truly once-in-a-lifetime experience. We're doing this at Cafe Max, so this is how we do our once-in-a-lifetime vineyards at Cafe. Chef Oliver Saucy is going to send out a few small courses, and then you can order whatever you want to off the menu, and uh, it is going to be an incredible night to remember for $450 a person, all, all inclusive? Are you kidding me? I better check that. Anyways, check it out. The listing of wines we've got. And we've got an offering from Odero, one of the top small producers uh, in Barolo, on this offering. Going all the way back to 96. I can't believe we still have these wines available to you. And you know what? The price? It's about the price of the current release of these wines. One of the greatest offers that we've had on Barolo this year. Check it out. I'm your host, Andrew Lampasoni, signing off for the Wine Watch, saying, remember, always drink the good stuff first.